Okay. Should I go now? Okay. Um, yeah, I guess I should uh, sh share and start by kind of saying that um, I've been an operator in this field for five, whew, maybe uh, seven years now. No, that's not right. I, I want to say six. Um, but anyway, it seems like a lifetime, uh, given how many changes happened in the field, how many uh, different challenges I've had to face. But um, it's all been great. Uh, the one thing I'd say is that, um, you know, for, in terms of staying power, you need to be able to learn how to learn. Things are constantly changing in this field, keeping up with the tech, learning how we can work for you, how it works, what its quirks are, um, all that type of stuff. Um, and then the last thing I'd probably say is that uh, people tend to glamorize this solo operator type of lifestyle, like you can do it all yourself. And I almost find like the exact opposite to be true in that um, the secret here is uh, learning how to build and find your tribe um, and uh, learning to find like-minded people that share your vision, that support your vision, that want to uh, create like you, um, because I think in the long run, you'll go much further uh, with a team. And so that always remains true in my entire career uh, in different roles. It's always been true, like learning how to, how and when to effectively use a team to get further um, is always kind of like the secret sauce. So, all right. I mean, that's it. Like, you think that works? All right, <laughs> let's give it a shot.